Welcome to today's episode of How the Game Was Won. And today we're looking at a game between Michael Adams with the white pieces and Maxim Matlikov with the black pieces. This game was played at the European Club Cup on the 24th of October 2015. And without further ado, let's see how this game developed out of the smooth look variation of the Spanish defense. Obviously, starting off e5, e4, e5, knight f3, knight c6, bishop e5, a6, bishop a4, knight f6, castle is short, bishop e7, rook e1, d5, bishop e3, castle is short, c3, d6, h3, rook e8, d4, bishop b6, bishop b7, knight b to d2, bishop f8, a3, h6, d5, knight b8, Knight h2, knight b to d7, knight g4, knight c5, knight f6, check, king takes f6, and bishop c2, c6, b4, knight e7, knight b3, c takes in d5, knight a5, rook a to d8, knight takes in d7, rook takes in d7, king takes in d5, rook c7, king b3, rook e to c8, bishop d2, Knight b6, a4, knight c4, a takes in b5, a takes in b5, and now, now that the dust has more or less cleared, and we well and truly established in the middle game, we can look and see that, obviously, black has played a knight out to c4, which in turn attacks Montalo, attack that bishop down on d2 and instead of repeating it Michael Adams finds a truly amazing solution in this situation and that's playing bishop d3 bishop b3 the threat of course is to the short term threat of course is the the threat of taking on c4 and if the rook then takes back, black is left with a permanent and lasting weakness of that um, of that b5 pawn. And if the pawn recaptures, like that, then it results in a brilliant pass pawn for white. So it's a really tricky situation for Matlakov to have to deal with in, in this situation. And his choice is to play knight takes on d2, queen takes on d2, rook takes on c3. Rook e3. Rook takes on e3, f takes on e3. Rook c7, bishop d5. Now, at the moment, black is a pawn up, but his bishop, such as sitting on f8, is clearly inferior to the monster bishop that Michael Adams has got centralized on d5. And this proves to be fairly key as far as the winding up of the position is concerned. g6, queen d3. Queen g5, rook f1, h5, rook f3, queen h4, king f2. Obviously, safeguarding his king before embarking on the queen invasion into the enemy camp. Bishop h6, bishop, queen takes on b5, king h7, queen e8, bishop g7, bishop takes on f7, rook e7, queen d8, and everything is completely falling apart. For instance, just to start off with, that d6 pawn is completely hanging and is going to be falling really, really soon. Later, the g6 pawn will disappear as well. And all in all, Matlikov's decision to resign in this position is completely valid. His position is falling apart and a player of the caliber caliber of Michael Adams will have 
no problems whatsoever in winding up up in uh, using CE superior technique to wind up the vision. And in addition to the fact that those two pawns are going to be falling, White is sitting also with this monster pass pawn on B4 that is getting ready to march all the way through. Bearing in mind, of course, that it will be difficult, it will take a good couple of moves for the Black Queen, for instance, to be able to get down and around and out to be able to defend against that uh, marching pawn. And should the Black Queen, for instance, be making that surge and around for, um, via E1, for instance, it will take the queen away from being able to defend against the monstrous um, coordinated pieces that white has storming against the black king. So that is how the game was won. Feel free to share this video out amongst all of your chess friends. Remember to post any comments, questions, criticisms that you have in the comment section down below the video. Thumbs up if you like the content, thumbs down if not. And Last but by no means least, remember that down below the video screen in YouTube is a red subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button, that way you stay subscribed to my channel for all the new video content that comes out on a day-to-day, week-to-week basis. Until we meet next time for another episode of How the Game Was Won, stay carved up for the win, and I'll see you then. Cheers.